It's Aristia, 100 metres to go. Still over a length in front of Guafila, and it's Aristia for the Wakeful. Aristia just in front of Graceful Glover. Aristia, Aristia on the edge from Graceful Glover. So Aristia was named after the um, VRC Group 1 Oaks winner, uh, Aristia, and um, John Gussett was um, a part owner in her, and now he's named the farm, and um, Aristia Bloodsock and that after her. So that's he's got his passion about horses and from her, and he's gone from there. We're about an hour out of Melbourne, um, heading towards Phillip Island. It's about 100 acres, uh, lovely 30 mares we've got here at the moment and John's just planning on building that and making it more commercial. The pasture's brilliant here year round. We've got beautiful clover and rye pasture and it's a great place to raise young horses. Our yearling prep is very nature-based. I really love them to have paddock time, as much paddock time as we can possibly give them at the moment when the weather plays nicely, it's 24 seven. I like to be hands-on with the horses every day. It's all hand walking lunging, um, leading off the pony. That education that you set up really does set them up for the rest of their life. It makes their breaking in a lot easier. And even after racing, it just sets them up for a, a nice life. Yeah, we've got the freedom to do what we want and how we want to do it. And getting the horses to be happy and healthy and is what you want and get the uh, results on the racetrack. English Premier Sale is just outstanding. Just uh, so lucky to be presenting these cults. Yeah, they're just lovely cracking types. We're very privileged to um, be a part of it. John's taking this draft to Melbourne to support the state. We could have taken these horses anywhere in the country. They're very commercial, it's a super draft and we need to be supporting Victoria in this. Yeah, I'm very lucky to have 14 gun Inglis Premier Gilling Sales with kick it off in Victoria. It's a really strong draft overall, you've got um, the gold bully in half in Gold Rush. She's a, a super moving filly. She's really lovely. Also the bold aerial, you know, lovely early type out of a lovely Vinny mare. Yeah, he's got a great temperament. He's lovely, strong, short coupled horse. And the Glows Lonro Colt is a beautiful, loose moving athlete. He's really super. He's a very sensible, great attitude. Ah, uh, this is the Frankel Philonikia Colt. He's uh, got a great international family. He's also great length and scope about him. He's just a nice, natural sort of moving horse. Um, flows along the ground really well. Takes everything in his stride. He just doesn't get fussed about anything. It doesn't matter what you do with him. He just is happy to do it. I think you do have to pinch yourself when you are given such an amazing group of horses to work with and the freedom to be able to do your absolute best.